I don't know how I can take off after after uh, Joseph. <laughs> that was awesome. Um, but it but it rings true that 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 love and that passion for Yahweh and His Messiah Yahushua um, has to shine forth. You know, I mean, uh, I, I was I was thinking of the last command that we were given by the master before he before he uh, offered himself up and that was to love one another you know and and that rings true from the from the oldest person to the to the person that just walks through the door you know that that you 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 walk up and you and and you give them a hug and and, and you let them know you know it, it's you know you show them messiah you show it, show it to them. And if, if, if I'm true with that love, that's going to, that's, that's going to speak. I, I mean, it'll, it, it, I won't, it won't even be, you won't, I won't have to speak because it'll, it'll ring true. It'll be true. You can't manufacture it. You can't buy it in the store. It has to come directly from the heart. And to me that, that love, ha, uh, that love comes from what he did, what he did for me. He gave me his name. He gave me the name of his father. You know, um, he called me. He, when I was asking for, when I was asking for um, more truth, and I don't know how long I was praying for that, but I was asking for more truth. And, and then that's when, that's when everything just kind of came up with uh, hearing his name and, and, and everything since then, um, that it was, you know, you, you, you ask for just a little bit and he, and he gives you so much more. And that's part of what I believe that I'm called to do is, you know, he, he, he told his thought ones, he says, I'm sending you out as sheep among wolves, be as wise as serpents and harmless as doves. And, you know, give it away. What I have given you, you've received freely. So give it. We're not meant to keep it to ourselves. We're meant to hand it out. We're meant to give it away. Because what good does it do us? You know, if I just, if I just keep it to myself, I'm not, I'm not doing what he commanded. You know, and part of that love is sharing him, sharing what he gave me. Um, you know, uh, and also the, for me, the, 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 the naming of the naming of the assembly and, and putting, uh, putting Yahweh's name on the building. Um, and Joseph Setter was talking about Solomon's, the temple of Solomon and, and, and uh, the house of Yahweh. You know, that's what it was. It was a place for his. It was a place for Yahweh's name, and uh, this is like a. This has a double effect because it's not only Yahweh's name. You also have Yeshua's name on the building too. So it's <laughs> the house of Yahweh and the house of Yahweh's salvation. Um, you know, I took. I take it. I take it very seriously the the names i i um some people i've heard you know compromise and 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 i just can't i can't and and i guess the the reason why i i say that is because i can't there wasn't a time before that i knew his name when i felt the way that i feel now you know I didn't experience those things. I'm not saying it didn't doesn't happen in in church or in, in, in but it but it didn't happen for me. You know, um, I mean, I, the things that I've seen, the, the the things that I've witnessed, and just the just the love. I mean, we had the first tabernacles where I went to, where there was a bunch of people. We had 76 people, and it was in 2009. And trying to get 76 people to do anything, let alone stay in one room that wanted to stay in the same room and fellowship with each other all day long is just absolutely amazing. And from that, 
from that day, from the first day to the eighth day, every time somebody came in, we would stop and welcome that person, give them a hug, introduce ourselves to them. It was called the it was called by Robert the Feast of a Thousand Hugs. You know, but it was but it was awesome. I mean, because you would hear the you would hear the you would hear the ram's horn in the night in the morning, and you would go to the, and as soon as you got up, you would go to the you would go to the where we were meeting, and where we ate was the same place as where we fellowship was the same place as where we kept services, and everybody stayed all day long. Didn't we didn't want to go. You would go home. I mean, you might go to your camp, you might go to your camper or trailer or wherever you were sleeping in your tent, and you would be there all night. Be be eleven, twelve o'clock at night, but you would be back up early the next day. So the lifting up of Yahweh and His Messiah Yahushua is 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 amazing, and it has to be to me the the, the biggest thing. So, thank you.